Good day, good day. How the hulk are you today? Yes. Welcome to Roverland. I'm your friend Dan O. And I've got the Land Rover Collectibles today, I guess is what we're going to call it. I don't know. There we go. We got some brighter light going on here. I have had these uh, for a long time, and we're going to take a look at them. We're going to look at this one first. Um, obviously, I bought these off of eBay. I am not sponsored by these people at all. This is just part of my uh, Land Rover collection other than die cast that I have, although this is a die cast model. Uh, Auto Drive. I'm not really sure where this company is out of. I I don't normally buy overseas uh, on eBay, but a USB flash drive, plug-in, headlights, flashing for use. There you go. Um, there's the details. I guess it's a four gig, gigabyte. Uh, yeah, and I've, I've had this for quite a while. Simple, portable, personal storage. There you go. Uh, as I see it, uh, headlights come out there. Um, whoa, yeah, focus in there. Now this is a Welly um, die casting. Yes, I believe all of them. Uh, they, you know, obviously they did more than just a Land Rover, but uh, yeah, this one is a, a Welly. Uh, I don't know if there's anything in the box that's going to be any more telltale signing or signs or anything like that. But uh, very kind of nice. No, that's pretty much it. Just a little plastic housing there for the uh, model. So let's take a look at the model. And you know, I really don't know uh, what I paid for this little bugger. Uh, but she's, he's a cutie. Yeah, this is a Land Rover 90. I think they had a couple of car, uh, different um, colors available, I and uh, I think uh, I love these wheels. These wheels are just the coolest Land Rover wheels ever. That's what I like. Pretty good proportionate. We're uh, guess I guess we're looking at the uh, Welly. No, oh, let's take a look at it here. It does say Welly on the bottom. He just wants to pick up and read the background here. But uh, you see there, Welly, the uh, number, made in China, Land Rover Defender. And then here's the little button. You kind of <clears throat> you kind of just have to uh, kind of push on it uh, just a little bit. It kind of clicks in spots, so you kind of push down and then drag it back and forth. And bloop, there it comes right out the back is the USB uh, drive to it. Pretty awesome, pretty awesome. So, I don't know. Uh, look at the license plate, Land Rover. Detailed, uh, like a Welly model would be. Uh, just super, super nice. Now, the added bonus is it has LED lights just for the headlights. Nicely uh, uh, machined out, drilled out there. I really like that. And uh, just a really neat little bugger. I don't have, I don't think, too much on this one right here. Um, to tell you the truth, I may have a file of uh, Land Rover nudes on there. Yeah, <laughs> cheese balls, really? Yeah, I don't know. I might, uh, I might have stored some Land Rover pictures that had nude ladies on them. I'm not sure. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> hey, you got to have the, a spiced up collection too. But anyway, just a backup from the old computer. I, I can't remember. But anyway, there it is. The uh, Land Rover uh, Defender from Welly from um, the Auto Drive. Yeah, yeah. I don't use it really too much. Uh, matter of fact, I almost misplaced it. I had to find it in the cabinet. I was like, where did I store that? And uh, here's the other one that I have, Click Car Stick, a USB, must be 2.0. 2 this is the Range Rover Evoke in white, four gigabytes, four gigabytes, yeah. And we'll just take a look at the packaging here real quick. Now it does, it did come with a free little bag. 
And I think you can still buy this. Um, still, I'm not really sure. And uh, here's the back. Portable. Yeah, there you go. Headlights and taillights. Free running wheels. There you go. Uh, that's a trademark 2011. It could be that that uh, long ago that I had gotten this one. Let's just take a look at the packaging. It just that was a little thing for hanging it up. I don't know if there's any uh, special uh, uh, stuff on here that uh, any any uh, I don't know. I don't know. I can't get it open. Anyway, let's not look at that. Here, look, look, here's the free bag. Uh, funny story is, I lost this thing for like a couple of months. Yeah, several months. Made me sick to my stomach. I sold uh, a car, my everyday driver, and I must have put it in my sales bag. I was doing sales for the radio station, and I don't know. I thought I sold, I, it was in the car that I sold. I couldn't find it for the longest time. Oh my God, I was just sick to my stomach. I'm like, oh, dude. And this thing, I think, cost me over 20 bucks or so, you know. So it was like, oh, man. And I really don't know what I've got on here. Maybe I got my Land Rover nudes on here. I don't know. But anyway, anyway, very cool. Let's take a look. It doesn't have a uh, make like the other one did, uh, that it was a, a welly or anything like that. And this is a little bit different. Um... It's just got a, a base that they, uh, little tiny screws on there, and the base has got the hinged uh, USB port that uh, sits underneath there, and uh, doesn't drag or anything like that, and uh, just sits under there. So then you just flip the USB out and plug it into your computer, in my case, the, uh, the good old laptop, and uh, yeah, the re tail lights uh, light up and the headlights light up. And so it's really kind of cool. Really kind of cool. This uh, Evoke two-door, I'd really like to get one of these. I, I, I'd really like to, uh, what is it, the Dynamic? Isn't that the top of the line? I don't know. Maybe that's the bottom of the line. But yeah, someday maybe I can get myself a Land Rover Evoke. And that would be very, very nice. Uh, I'm not really a two-door kind of guy. I like convertibles, but I don't think I will be ever be able to afford a Land Rover Range Rover Evoke convertible, although that would be number two on my list. Number one would be the Defender 90, AA 90, 1997, AA yellow convertible with the, uh, of course, fiberglass plastic replacement you know that we could put on during the summer winter but uh very nice very nice do you guys have any of these these uh these are kind of neat this is just kind of uh something from the land rover collectibles that i uh have and i wanted to show you um is there uh if you guys like what you see go ahead and give me the big thumbs up Go ahead and subscribe, and uh, yeah, come on over to Facebook, Roverland. We're over uh, 125 uh, members, I think, something like that, 120, and uh, just growing leaps and bounds over there. Uh, make sure you subscribe here. Boy, we're almost at uh, 200 at the uh, recording of this one video. And just, uh, yeah, we're, we're pecking away, getting, uh, uh, new subscribers every week. And that is awesome. That is awesome. Also, uh, come on over to Instagram, Roverland channel on Instagram and check it out there. All right. But yeah, Facebook is a good place. Everybody seems to have Facebook so they can go ahead and, uh, drop down comments and pictures there of your uh, Land Rover Electronics that you have in your collection. Do you collect anything like this, huh? Yeah, this is some cool stuff if you ask me. All right, there you go. Really kind of cool Land Rover collectibles here on Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. 
with your friend Dan O. Make sure you drop a comment and give me a hello, all right? All right, that's it. Remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.